and like for the SEC and just see how you gotta use that type of technique to get the better of them for real. How much different is the position? Um, the different of the position is just like the lineup, you know, the formations. Sometimes you'll be in the two point stands, and sometimes you'll be in the three point stands. It might be in the wide receiver stands. It's just different ways because in the wide receiver, you're always in that wide receiver stands. Mm -hmm. So it's just uh, pretty much like getting used to different things. When you learned that you were in a switch, did you think that like you'd be thrown to the fire this quickly? Oh yeah, it's been a thought. So I knew that they're gonna try to use me as soon as I turn into that tight end position because I'm trying to help the team win. So they're gonna put on like the players that wants to help the team win, which I do. So I'm 100 into it and I'm ready to get it going. When you when you say Coach Mero, even back in high school, talked to you about being maybe a flex tight end at that position. When you see guys like Kyle Pitts or guys in the pros like you know the tech. Kittle, uh, Travis Kelsey, people like that. What do you what do you think about the position as a whole of being a flex tight end? Yeah, it's just like an athletic tight end, so that can make mismatch problems. So uh, I feel like that really helps to see like those guys that actually are athletic tight ends and see that I can probably take like some games off of them. So Coach Cal, he used to say position was basketball. It feels like there's a lot of you know you got a receiver playing a tight end, you got running back splitting out a wide receiver. It's, it sounds like there's a lot of moving parts, kind of more so than, than we've seen before. Is that is that fair? Oh yeah, it keeps the defense thinking like what's going on on the field because you see a running back out to the wide receiver all the way out wide. You're like, what's going on? And like a tight end probably go out to a receiver, but you just never know. We're always like moving around and keeping the defense like on their toes when they're out there. Have y'all been handing it, taking it to the defense so far this preseason? Um, we've been doing our thing and they've been doing everything as well. So it goes back and forth. Like we'll, they'll have a run and then we'll have a run right back. So we both know how to respond to each other when it happens. I think they already answered this, but when you were kind of weighing the decision, what you wanted to do is start receiver move the tight end. I guess what maybe outweighed things more than anything else? What did you say? Just kind of, I guess, when you were making that decision, mm -hmm. the tight end, is there any big thing that stood out to you that made you decide that that's... I'm um, just like uh, knowing that who the coach is too, Coach Morrow. I have probably the best relationship with him, so like that kind of made it more comfortable as well because I already knew uh, Coach Morrow before, and just knowing that he knows how to utilize his tight ends and make sure that they can do good as well.